Now I'm going to share with you three kinds of prayer to build up the relationship with God. Three kinds of prayer. One kind of prayer is the prayer of grace. And the second kind is prayer of worship. The third kind is interactive prayer. So first is prayer of grace, and then prayer of worship, and then interactive prayer. Prayer of grace is declaring God is loving us. God is blessing us. God has a wonderful plan in our life. God wants to do greater things in our life. So this is a prayer of grace from God to us from God to us. And that prayer of worship, it says, I love you, Lord. I worship you, Lord. It's from us to God. And I add in expression more personal, like this. Lord, I need you. I hold on to you. I pray like this. Lord, I hold on to you. I like you. I pray like this because of the faith in God, I know God's one and intimate relationship. So I pray like this, Lord, I like you. I enjoy you. I want you. I need you all the time. So I hold on to God all the time. Now, let me tell you, when I pray like this, it gives me faith and strength. And I have motivation to come close to God. And the third kind is interactive prayer. What does that mean? That means in the prayer of grace and in the worship, the prayer of worship, I believe God at the same time is very happy because the Bible says that. When we repent, God is very happy. When we come close to God, God will come close to us. And God is near to those who pray to Him with a sincere heart. That's Psalm 145. God is close to him who pray to him with a sincere heart. So anytime we pray, God is very happy. But many people pray like this. Oh God, where are you? Please come God, I need you. I want you. Where are you now? Many people, when they pray, they are afraid God is far away. But when we pray, we can believe God is listening to us. You know, in, um, in Old Testament it says that God listened to us. God listened to us when we pray. For all those people who discuss about God, the people of God who discuss about God, God is very happy. So whenever I pray, I say God is very happy. That gives me strength. And, and I notice the blessings of God come to me. I notice all kinds of blessings and confirmation when I have this faith in God, when I believe in this grace. Let me give you some example. There are 10 times before I went to a certain country, there were people who dreamed about me before they knew me in person. And there was one person in South Africa, you know, on YouTube, South Africa and that pastor, Yip. You can see many of my videos on we uh, YouTube and Facebook, you look for Pastor Yip, Y-I-P, that's my last name, Pastor Yip. And you can see this woman in South Africa. In the dream, she was chased by someone and she was afraid. She was afraid. And then she went to a house and she saw a Chinese boy inside. And she went inside. And she asked the boy to open the door. And she went inside, there were Chinese praying. And she said this is the first time that she saw Chinese in her dream. And then I appeared and I said to her, do you like me to pray for you? And then when a moment I lay hand on her, she felt joy and love and she woke up in, from the dream full of joy and love. This is one example of a confirmation from God, that God will speak to the people before I went there. Now, I'm not saying I'm special. I'm saying God is special. Yes, sir. The moment we love God, God is very happy. God will reward you and God will bless you. The moment you pray with a sincere heart and really love God and honor God, God really likes it. 
and God will bless you. So I hope you all have this faith. So let me go through these three prayers again. Prayer of grace is from God. God loves me. God cares about me. And then prayer of worship. I worship you. I love you. I need you. I want you. And the third kind is interactive prayer. Whenever we pray, God is very happy. And God wants to bless us. Okay? Now, I give you some prayer. And then you tell me which one it is. Okay? God, I love you. God, I love you. What kind is it? Worship, right? Very good. God is listening to me now. Interactive. Interactive. Yeah, when I pray to God, He's listening to me. God is blessing me now. Grace. Grace. Very good. Very good. I need you, Lord. I need you, Lord. What is that? Worship. Worship. Yes. Very good. You're learning it. God has a wonderful plan in our lives. Grace. Yeah, that is grace. Whenever I pray, God is listening. Interactive. Very good. So what I'm saying is, if every day when we pray, we say, God is happy to hear my prayer, God wants to bless me, and then we have confidence in God. Now some people say, but we're not good enough. It's true we're not good enough. Can, is God really pleased with me? Let me tell you, God gave me this teaching. It's easy to please God. It's not easy to be perfect. We cannot be perfect. But it's easy to please God. Whenever we re repent, God is pleased. Whenever we pray to Him, He is pleased. Whenever we obey Him, He is pleased. Whenever we serve Him, even a cup of cold water, he is pleased. Now, but pleasing God doesn't mean we are perfect. We are not perfect. I'm not perfect. I try to be as perfect as I can. The moment I have sinful thoughts, immediately I take care of it. The motivation is I know God knows my thoughts. If I obey Him totally, He will bless my life. And if I sin, it will block the blessings of God. It will block my relationship with God. So I obey Him in every single way. But I obey Him with joy and peace. Okay? Now, um, so I hope you learn this kind of prayer. Let me, what's the time is it now? What time is it now? Huh? 11 to 12. 11.25. 11.25. Okay, maybe we have a short pause. Okay. We have a short pause, uh, a rest, and then we'll come back to some more important teaching applied to this. And in this rest time, you can love God and believe that God is loving you. And enjoy the presence of God. God is loving me now. God has a wonderful plan in my life now. God wants to do great things in my life now. And God can provide for me.